What to choose? What to choose? Buff command? No. It's a piece of shit. In no. Cunt stuffer it is. I always like that class. What's up, ladies and gents? Excalizor is here, bringing you some team deathmatch on Afghan. I will be using Akimbo Vectors and Akimbo Rafikas with Marathon Lightweight and Steady Aim All Pro. Because I am a pro. No. I'm not really that pro. I'm alright, but, uh. Yep, anyway, anyway. Moving on, um. You all. You definitely wanna. When you're rolling with akimbo subs, you definitely want to roll with either rangers or G18s or Rafikas because you need a secondary that is better than your primary because unfortunately for... Oh baby, a triple! <laughs> oh, that was terrible, I'm sorry. Uh, for those who have no idea what's going on, um, people keep telling me, or Pyro Puncher specifically, is always talking about this little kid who made a, a video of a 12 year old getting a triple in a private match and he goes crazy so that's where that is from but uh, anyway as I was saying unfortunately akimbo subs are really not that good and are really not they don't even really compare to akimbo rap because G18s or rangers most of the time and you know, it'd be nice if I got great rounds with the Kimbo subs, but fortunately they do not happen very often. So more or less they're just pretty pretty much a gimmick. It's another case of secondaries be being better than primaries, but hey, what do I know? I'm the idiot who paid 65 bucks for this game. But uh I mean they are fun to use. You definitely want to use Marathon and lightweight because it's strictly close range only. There is no, there will be no sniper shotgunning going on with these classes. And if at first you fail, just respawn and throw a trusty Johnny Unitas random semtech grenade. It always works. Works for him. <laughs> and yes, that is one of the guys I meant to just kill. You can check for yourself, but. Yeah, definitely want to go with marathon and lightweight so you can close the distance and get around to whatever needs to be gotten to is, uh... or or you, you could use I mean it doesn't really matter what you use I mean you could use you, you could use bling and and hardline if you wanted if you wanted to sit in the corners that that'll work fine works a little too fine but uh, you gotta play with the cards we're dealt with right and um, you know I would like to use commando instead because <laughs> if they're in a Kimbo sub range they're probably in commando range so I mean two and two right but I mean I, I tried it once in a Kimbo setup a Kimbo sub setup that is without stating and I can honestly say I did not have a very good round um I mean you had you had to be like in their face for for you to actually kill stuff but uh lesson learned and uh, apparently Greeny707 said no! No double pred for you, you must continue to work for your kills. I hate it when people do that, such jerk faces. And that's okay, I've got a Kimbo Rafikas to save the day. But uh, yeah, what was I talking about? I keep trailing off. <laughs> ha! Heat seeking martyrdom, or not martyrdom, but heat seeking frag grenade did not heat seek that time, but that's okay. It's okay. I like it when they don't do that. Just sit in the corner and not not roll towards me. So I can get my AC 130 to play the game for me. But uh yep, I mean they I mean they are trying to shoot it down, but round's pretty much close to over here, and there's not really much you can do, unfortunately, when You've got a guy in an AC-130 who's pretty much killing you as soon as you spawn. You can see that guy with cold blood had tried to kill me, but... You know, honestly, if you're gonna sh try and shoot stuff down with cold blooded, you gotta stay the hell away from your teammates because... I mean, splash damage will rape your face off, and... Wow, that, that could have been a... Easily been a 50 kill TDM game, but... Greeny, Greeny 707 screws me once again. But uh, 48, 48 kills and two deaths, can't complain. So, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Pea soup.
Be sure to follow us on Twitter. There you'll find the latest updates from our premier directors and the Machinima Respawn team.